Thank you very much. Um, this is a great festival. I pitched this film here three years ago. And um, to be honest, the BC Arts Council and the Canada Council for the Arts are the only funding this film ever obtained. And the support from them was wonderful. Um, the support from I Steel Film in Montreal was unflinching. And um, in terms of mountain culture, uh, there's a place called Clash Quiche, and it's on the west coast of Vancouver Island on the northern tip. And it's surrounded by really steep mountains, primarily of the Brooks Peninsula. And this area was uh, not glaciated, so no glaciers, no ice in the last ice age. And the, uh, the area it protects, Clash Quiche, is a low valley bottom where there is an ancient rainforest. And when I first started filming, this place was pristine. And 10,000 people had lived in that area over thousands of years, the Kwakwaiakwa people. And it was really hard for me to find any remains of their existence. There were a few areas where their longhouses had been and some midden. And there were a few trees that had been altered hundreds of years ago. And then they blasted a road into the mountains. And the whole upper valley has been destroyed by our government because it's public land. And it's been destroyed by the industry. And 40% of the logs in BC are exported as raw logs. So those jobs aren't staying here. Our economy is not thriving because of that. The same thing's happening in the Great Bear Rainforest where not only did they agree to cut down two-thirds of that forest, but now they're going to allow Enbridge, maybe, if the public doesn't say no, to put a pipeline through that area and take gas and oil from the tar sands in the north of our country to China and perhaps devastate our entire coast. That's mountain culture today. But one man gives me hope, and his name is Quoxy Stalla, and he's standing beside me, and he taught me that there is a way to live with the land, and that we have to start listening to the elders. So I'm going to let you listen. He's going to sing a song for you.
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.